Good morning, YTPC. Yes, we made it another Saturday in the books. Work week was crazy. Hope everybody's doing well. Today I decided I'm gonna start the HU tobaccos. I'm gonna start with Haymaker. This one's a straight Virginia. Never had it. Uh, I believe this is one of the only ones that is a straight Virginia that I got. I think a lot of them are Vapors and uh, Vapor Perique in Kentucky. There's a couple that are just straight Virginias. Let's get this cracked and see what we got going on. Looks like some aged tobacco already. I mean, that's like, that's almost like a plug. <laughs> the lighting out here sucks. There's no pulling. Oh, maybe. Nah, there's no. No pulling a flake off of that without ripping it too. It kind of smells, it, it kind of smells like Latakia actually. I'm picking up like a, almost like a licorice topping, but there's not supposed to be little to any casing or topping. I'm picking up it smells like Latakia. It smells like uh, strong, smoky. This would be interesting. Let me get my pipe packed and I gave my thoughts. Okay, YouTubers, we're back. Smoking this in one of my custom cobs. Look at it. Right off the bat, this is not a Virginia that I've ever smoked before, flake straight like that. This is strong, this is robust, this is bold. Punch you in the face in uh, taste. I didn't go back and check my notes because I want to uh, smoke it first and get my first impressions, but I may be wrong. There might be something else mixed with this, but as uh, far as I knew, it was a straight Virginia, but uh, it tastes like there's like Latakia or some Kentucky dark fired in there. I mean, it is strong. In a good way, though. Uh, it almost tastes like Samuel Gow with full Virginia flake without all the sweetness. Tastes like some well-aged tobacco. I don't know how old the tin is. Uh, I know it's over three months old from the time it got here. As I can remember, that pure tobacco, natural sweet taste from the HU tobaccos. Some sweetness, but you really got to search for it. It's 
still tolerable on the retro hell, but uh, it's strong. Uh, I'm not sure nicotine wise how strong it is, but in taste, it's very strong. I don't have anything to compare it to because I've never had a straight Virginia flake like this. If that's what it is. <laughs> Definitely can see some darks and some lighter in there. But it is just like a well-aged plug. Very nice. Solid. <laughs> Would I buy it again? Absolutely. Just hope if I do, it's not three-month ordeal next time. Fairly easy to keep lit, and uh, you're not going to get any tongue bite or anything like that, but it is, be warned, it is a strong Virginia flake. As always, try and leave comments below. It's why I do these. I'm going to try and start keeping my videos under five minutes or so. Nobody likes to watch longer videos with a bunch of rambling anyway. Definitely something unique I've never had before. Hope everybody has a good weekend. Talk to you boys and girls later.